Good morning, everyone. I hope you're having a great day, night, wherever you're at, whatever you're doing. I hope it's great. Today, I just wanted to check in with you and see what's going on. Um, I get hit. I'm losing so much hair and it keeps like, I mean, so much hair. It's crazy. Anyway. I have been motivated to do more self-work um, again because I feel like in a way I've lost um, a feeling of control and sorry and um, Definitely going to minimize my stuff again. Uh, but this time I'm going to store it away instead of just getting rid of it. Uh, I have a lot of stuff that I have already like decluttered and, and things like that. But in the time that... The time between then and now, I've collected some stuff. And uh, I think once I get my last package of things, then I will show you guys kind of um, what I'm getting rid of. And also, I'm listening to people that I look up to on like podcasts and things like that. Somebody I aspire to be like or have the same traits as. Uh, so that's exciting. I'm not sure how it's going to work out. With bipolar, you kind of like switch your minds a lot. And I'm going to put on my socks. Guys. Friends, socks. There's so much hair. Uh, yes. So today I'm going up to Jeff and I'm getting ready to, tomorrow, I am going to meet with the Voc Rehab lady. They are going to pay for um, my test that I have to retake. And then hopefully I'll pass it. I don't know. I'm a nervous wreck about it. Have been since I've stopped. And, sorry, um, so it, it is what it is, you know, it is what it is, it, it, you just gotta take it as it comes, but, uh, yeah, so once I pass that, cause I'm gonna keep taking it until I pass, uh, then I can start getting my new business uh, set up. And it's going to be a small business, probably like $10,000 a year, maybe, you know. That's like a goal of mine for massage therapy. You don't really make enough to make a living on, really. I mean, it, it can be done, but it's very hard. So I have the other job that I'll continue to work on and um, if the business side of things doesn't work out then I'll just go to the original um, one that I got hired at and um, if that's possible I don't know but that's where that's at <laughs> oh guys I oh let me tell you, this Trazodone sucks ass. It sucks. I took it as, um, I took a half a pill. And usually if I take like Tylenol PM or melatonin, I have to take it like four hours in advance for it to like actually kick in and not leave me tired the following morning. 
um, Trazodone has made me, I think, hypomanic, but not like in like a severe way, just more energy. Uh, and I think I'm going to have to call my doctor and ask her for something else. I don't know what else Trazodone could be used for. I need to look it up, but trazodone, not fun. Um, what else is going on? I'm meeting with a girl that I went to school with tomorrow. Tonight is Caden's um, concert that they have at school, and tomorrow. I'm meeting with the Voc Rehab lady, and I'm also going to see a girl that I went to school with. I think I already said that. So, pretty busy couple of days. The massage lady that I met with this past week, which was like almost like a blind date. <laughs> mm. Uh, I'm going to meet with, I think, I'm going to write some questions down on a piece of paper and we're going to meet again because I was so out there for the original meeting. So, there's that. Okay, guys, uh, I just wanted to legit check in. I don't have much to say except the update on the medicine in case you're thinking about taking it. Um, I know someone else who also does not do well on trazodone. It also does the same effect for them and I don't think that's the only time I've heard that so <sighs> yep that's what I've got but you know, if you're feeling not in a good mood, uh, I've been there like off and on. So even though I'm not all the way down, I still know where my mentality would be if it was just all down. But the the majority of the time it has been pretty hyper not to an extreme where well I can't really say that but um yeah I'd rather be hypomanic than depressed for sure but if you're feeling depressed just keep hanging in there you know you've got this I know life is not easy and it seems like there's days where you just don't want to shower, you don't want to do anything at all. You just legit want to stay in bed and not have anybody come and talk to you and just sit in solitary and sleep. Or at least that's what I like to do. And um, I don't know. Um, I had an anxiety attack also. I meant to tell you guys that. And it was pretty scary. So there was that. But anyway, if you're feeling good, I'm happy. That's, that's what it is. That's all I can say. Um, whatever day you're watching this on, I hope it's great. And I hope that you guys know that I love you. If you're not feeling love today, I've got true love. So I will share it. Um, but yeah, you've always got a friend here. And... Or somebody who at least understands the process. So with that being said, I will let you guys go. And I will talk to you later. Bye.